Hey y'all, I'm Parisian and this is Dream of Parisian Tarot. We're gonna get a few cards from my Scorpios, okay? So please like this video if it resonates at all. Also, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe and don't forget to check out my TikTok. The link is down below in the description box. And if you would like a personal reading, that information is also down below in the description box. Let's get a few cards from my Scorpios, okay? So the first card I'm seeing is daddy's girl. Okay, so some of y'all could be a daddy's girl. I'm also seeing wedding planner. So someone could be planning a wedding. Somebody could be planning to propose to you. Um, a marriage could be happening, period, okay? They said they don't have shit to offer you. The Empress is becoming more stable. I love to see it when it comes out. So y'all could be um, stabilizing your foundation and, you know, securing your nest in some type of way. But we have victory is coming. So yeah, I've been seeing that a lot in the Scorpio's reading. We got is this safe? Somebody could be wondering if uh, they, whatever they're doing towards you is safe, okay? And remembering old memories. So somebody's been thinking about you a lot, thinking about past memories. He checked the karmic about you. So the karmic is not always the other woman. Karmics can be family members and friends too. But your masculine is going off on some type of karmic about you. This could definitely be someone from your past. Or someone from your past could be coming back. We got lucid dreaming. So definitely pay attention to your dreams. You're definitely receiving a lot of messages in your dreams right now. Okay, A lot of downloads. We got wondering how you heal from what they did to you. Because somebody was trying to sabotage you or harm you in some type of way. You got a different kind of vibe. So you could definitely be a different kind of person. People love your vibe. I'm also seeing something about a woman beater. Okay. And we got teeth whitening. Somebody could be getting their teeth did or going to the dentist or something like that. And it says, this bitch did the most to ruin your name. So somebody was trying to ruin your name and ruin your reputation, which goes along with wondering how you heal from what they did to you. But it says, desperate for your help or assistance. Um, a family member could be desperate for your help or assistance because it was on top of cousin involved. All right, so your cousin is involved in this situation. And we have a romantic man. So this romantic man is wanting to do something for you or take you out on some type of date or something like that. And it says they handled this situation wrong. So this romantic man made the wrong choice and made the wrong decision when it came towards you. And it looks like they want to make up for that. We also have thank you for your service. So whatever service that you do or whatever you're doing for other people, people are thankful for it. Uh, someone could work at a post office, okay? And you could be burning bridges with people. Um, also, something about some type of cute video. Somebody could be watching cute videos. Somebody could be making cute videos. In some type of way, this could be YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, something. But it say it's time to create, most definitely. Um, the big, the, in the pre-shuffle, the biggest energy I was seeing is that uh, some of y'all are about to take some type of risk or something like that. And uh, just keep putting one foot in front of the other because you're about to reach some type of milestone and get some type of success. Okay, you on the right path. From your pain comes something beautiful. All right. No one knows I still think about you. So you definitely on this person's mind, especially with remembering old memories being with right there. I'm also seeing something about a psychiatric nurse or some type of nurse, period. We have a birthday event could be coming up. Somebody could be going to a birthday event. And we have the gift of foresight. You could definitely have that, okay? Very psychic, very intuitive, a seer. We got trying to be a good father. So the first card that we did see was daddy's girl, right? So your daddy could be watching you or, or wanting to help you in some type of way or give something to you. And we have a spy. So somebody is spying on you, Scorpio, okay? Heavily. It says everyone knows she did wrong for what she did. So some type of female did you dirty in some type of way. We can see that with wondering how you heal from what they did to you. And this bitch did the most to ruin your name. We got travel and vacation. Y'all could be about to do that or wanting to do that. And we have a party bus. This could definitely have something to do with the birthday event up here or some type of wedding. But it says, I'm sorry, I'm sorry is on top of did you dirty, all right? And uh, under did you dirty was a karmic cycle is ending. So 
you was definitely dealing with some type of karmics again karmics can be family members and friends too but this is a karmic situation and it's ending at this time and like some type of victory or success is coming to you made the right decisions in some type of way uh, but they say i believe you now which means things are changing somebody might not have believed you at first but now they're starting to believe you because things are being exposed things are being revealed okay the truth is coming out and try harder so somebody definitely wants to try harder with you but also i feel it's I, i'm feeling the energy there's something that you may have tried or um having difficulties doing in some type of way but they just want you to put a little bit more effort in it because like i said you will uh, uh, reap some type of rewards from uh, get some type of success from it okay you outsmarted them so somebody was trying to outsmart you or do something better than you or take something from you but you ended up outsmarting them Somebody could work for the government. And it says personally attacked by someone you call a friend. So a friend could have did some dirty shit to you that was supposed to be a friend. You know what I'm saying? All right. We got mother figure sending you the evil eye. So this could be your mama, his mama, the karmic's mama, somebody mama. And we got the twin flame. So some of y'all are involved with your twin flame at this time. Perfume. You could be making perfume. You could smell the fuck good. Um, something like that. And it says, be careful with absorbing bad energy. Yes. So, you're going to have to cleanse your energy a lot. There could be people coming towards you, wanting to talk to you, wanting to work with you. But definitely don't absorb their energy. Don't absorb their bullshit. You can help them all you want. But make sure you uh, keep a line between your shit and their shit. All right? We also got trying to steal an opportunity from you. Yes, I keep seeing it. Um, someone's trying to steal something from you that you're about to get. But what's destined for you is destined for you. They cannot take it. All right? But be smart about your shit. Be smart about your moves because they're definitely watching your moves. All right? We got keep fighting. You almost there. You almost reached your milestone. Okay? Self-reflection. You could be doing a lot of self-reflection. And it's like y'all coming out of that energy at this time to create something. Okay? Um, we got a childhood love. Your childhood love it could be involved in this situation that could be that person from the past and we also got healing time that's what you're doing right now all right there's some type of situation that just needs more time and that could have something to do why try harder is here okay we need to defend yourself at this time so because somebody's trying to take you and steal something opportunity from you we got earth energy so a capricorn virgo taurus could be involved but also um when earth energy comes out you could be grounding yourself okay you could be focused on your health wealth and beauty nurturing yourself and other stuff like that okay but you need to ground yourself they got a weird obsession with trying to beat you they in competition with you and it says a sweet message to you somebody wants to send you a sweet message and talk to you and say, how the fuck did you know that? So you knew something. You mentioned something. You said something. They trying to figure out how the hell you know. And it says, my homeboys want to fuck you. So they homeboys definitely watching you. And you need to focus on your crap. Because I'm trying to tell you, from your pain, is about to birth something beautiful and prosperous. Dark chlorophyll. Not dark chlorophyll water. Some of y'all need to uh, drink more chlorophyll water in some type of way, Okay. And we got a house with a fireplace. So somebody could be looking for a house with a fireplace. Somebody could be moving into a house with a fireplace. That could be a certain place that got a fireplace that you know about something. Okay? And we got trust issues. You could have trust issues with someone. You got new members coming in if you have your own business or about to start your own business. You're going to have members. And we got 999 things coming to completion. It's the end of a cycle. Okay? Uh, online influencers want to work with you you're gonna have a lot of people wanting to come in and work with you talk with you um hang with you date you stuff like that okay and we got a modeling gig so somebody could be a model or somebody wants to um recruit you to be a model or something like that we got both in the relationship so you could be seeing somebody and um your person could be seeing somebody in some type of way okay so it's a foursome and we have an obnoxious teacher somebody could be dealing with that loves expensive things you need to drink more water. i definitely would just think about getting me a bottle of water i'm so thirsty we got outfit watching somebody watching your outfits they watching your next moves they watching where you about to go okay and it says when will i see you again somebody want to see you real bad and we got changing how you look you're going through some type of transformation or about to and somebody could have bought a pet or somebody could have a pet that they taking care of and talking shit about you okay also no 
if this is not happening directly to you it could be happening to your person or somebody around you so put it wherever it fits okay i could be saying he when really it could be the she so flip it and reverse it how need be for my scorpios is we got healthy choices you could be making healthy choices at this time or you need to but it says thank you angels for guiding me to make healthy decisions all right so this is really good and you're being rewarded for this all right we got connect with music so some of y'all could be getting messages and signs from music at this time so pay attention to what you're listening to um or what pops up when you go to the grocery store or something like that okay you're getting signs and synchronicities and messages thank you angels for inspiring me through music yeah so some of y'all about to get inspired to do something to create something new with the music i like to listen to piano playing a lot okay Honor your blessings. See, you about to get blessings and rewards. It says, thank you, Haniel, for supporting me as I honor my emotions. You can also be a bit emotional and sensitive. But like I said, through your pain, you're about to birth something beautiful and new and get some type of blessings or rewards. And we got to take a step back. Also, some of y'all could be attracted to the color blue and purple and gray. All right, um, uh, what am I saying? Take a step back. Thank you, angels, for helping me to step back from what's not serving me. So you could be um, revoking access from certain people, cutting certain people off, or taking a step back from certain things in some type of way. But it's to replenish yourself. It's to nurture yourself. It's to help you um, also think clearly in some type of way. So it looks like you may be um, reverting your focus towards something else, something um, creative in some type of way. Yeah, you manifest the miracles. It says, thank you, Orion, for manifesting your miracles in my world. So, yeah, because what you think is what you create. What you focus on is, is coming towards you, all right? So, it's like you're getting your focus right. You're getting your health right. Stuff like that. You're making healthier choices, which is really good. As soon as I open up the deck, the energy for my Scorpios is the King of Pentacles. So this is hubby material. They want to come lay roots with you in some type of way, build some type of foundation with you. They focus on their health, wealth, and, and, and beauty as well. All right? Um, but they definitely trying to get their money right right now. Let me see what's under that. The Hierophant. So um, you can have great wisdom or knowledge in some type of way where a lot of people are looking up to you and listening to you. Also, somebody could be in school or something like that the cherry victory and success they definitely looking towards marriage especially with the king of pentacles and the hierophant being here they could be looking for further knowledge on like where they gonna uh propose to you that's what i'm seeing advice about it they could be talking to other people about hey i'm thinking about marrying this girl that's what i'm seeing they trying to figure out what to do yeah and we got the fool on the other side. So some of y'all could be dealing with the, um, an Aquarius, a Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, heavy on the Taurus energy as well because Hierophant energy is Taurus energy. So you could be about to take some type of risk soon, but it's going to be a very, very good one. Cards from my Scorpios. Yep, yeah, judgment. Okay, so a lot of people could be judging you at this time or watching you in some type of way, but I'm also feeling like spirit God, your spirit guides and your ancestors have judged you in some type of way. And it looks like um you won or you made the right decision in something. Because I'm also seeing the Queen of Cups in the world, right? So the world is about leveling up, graduating, reaching milestones, also um worldwide view, a worldwide people viewing you in some type of way. So you could have been well, Scorp Queen of Cups is Scorpio energy, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy. Anyway, um, you could have been very sensitive about something, but also at the same time you was hurting and in pain, you could have been helping other people at the same time. So it's like um, you're going to be rewarded for like helping other people while you were still hurting and in pain too. Also, you could have came up with some type of new ideas, all right, or gave the right advice and helped someone and they want to come in and um, support you now. So it's like more support, more love and stuff like that is coming towards you and success. Like your judgment was right. Something that you did was right. 
and we got the four of cups there's somebody on the other side who was like not on the other side is like gone from this world but there's somebody watching you like level up and it's like causing them some type of headaches or pain it's like they rejecting the idea of you graduating leveling up and reaching milestones get what i'm saying all right let me see but this is beautiful and, and this goes right along with the creative energy that we was just seeing it's time to create because you have all this energy so you're gonna have to do something with it also something about your hair somebody's heavily focused on your hairstyles or your body okay and we got the four cups of gas we should show you that one we got the nine of pentacles so the nine of pentacles she's independent she's stable she's secure all on her own you know what i'm saying very independent type person so you could have decided to go independent in some type of way and somebody mad as fuck at you about it because this looks like the rise in phoenix so you've been through a lot of shit and you could be rising again but like i said somebody mad as fuck that you did this shit like they tried to stomp you down and you you just went through a rebirth it's like they can't fuck with you you know what i'm saying I love this new deck, y'all. I'm in love with it. The, the pictures are so pretty. And we got the Queen of Wands. So you out here looking very, very beautiful. Okay, the Queen of Wands usually has her own business. The best at what she do. She also magical as fuck. She be using her magic and shit and creating shit. Very creative energy. Um, but, but also she's very sexualized too. So you could definitely have multiple people who want you. Could be who could be talking about you or want to um like put you in like a modeling type situation or something like that something about your looks and beauty is being talked about period okay and whatever creative craft that you're doing but we got the nine and one so you can have your guards up with certain people so they can't get in so they people are finding a hard time trying to get in with you okay the lovers you got a spiritual union with another person but they had choices in love or either you had no both of y'all could have choices in love because it said both of you in a relationship so yeah <clears throat> As soon as I open up the deck, the energy for y'all is my karmic supplies me with drugs, money, and threesomes in the bedroom. So, they could be dealing with different people in some type of way, okay? Uh, so, they could be codependent on certain things as well because they get things from these karmics. And it says, I'm scared of change. I usually escape from it, but somehow you're changing me. So, this person could be used to toxic people, toxic things, but they also run away from you because you make them want to be a better person or change and it's scary to them it's like they know they need to but at the same time they scared of it or something so that's why they run it so they could ghost you or disappear or not respond sometimes or something like that again it wanted to come out i'm scared of change i usually escape from somehow you changing me and this person is very horny for you masturbating to your pictures okay can i please have a few cards from my scorpios yeah, but it says, I get so mad sometimes that I say things that I shouldn't have. So this person, they could have blew up at you or said some hurtful ass shit towards you. And now they want to come in and apologize. And it says, let's um, move in together. You feel like home. So they, you could be about to move into a home with a fireplace. Or maybe you live in a home with a fireplace. And they want to come in and move with you. And it says, intrigue. Sideline hoes spying on you. Okay. No. Oh. Y'all give me that. Please have another card for my Scorpios. Yeah, but it say we got so we got pay someone for spell work, okay? And it says I need to see you face to face, missing you, and we belong together. I can't imagine you being with anyone else but me. Okay, somebody could have paid someone for spell work to like bring you to them because they want to be with you. Okay, so somebody could be doing love spells on you, Scorpio. Um, but it's also connected to polyamorous trying to add another in their relationship and i can't leave them obligations so your person could be dealing with another person but they gotta stay with them could be like a baby mama wife whatever the fuck it is but they could definitely be bisexual or something like that because it's coming out with polyamorous all right so they could like want to add you into a poly relationship or something like that okay well y'all could be in there or something but we got my destiny. So you are this person's destiny. That's how they feel. I feel like we are meant to be. Okay. All right. As soon as I open up the deck, the energy from my Scorpios is she knows about you. So whoever they dealing with, they know about you. But it's like, baby, I love you. Also, somebody could be stealing your idea. So please keep them to yourself. Okay. Because y'all are about to birth something new. Can I 
please have a few calls from my Scorpio spirit. All right, we got some workplace drama. If you don't go somewhere for your work, your person could. They could be having workplace drama. Or this could be some actual work that you create or post or something like that, okay? But it says don't give up on this. They really don't want you to. Let's see. Can I please have a few calls from my Scorpios? They say every time we fuck, I fall more in love. And sex with them is born. I need you. Somebody is stealing from you. We got many love offers. So a lot of people want to come in and talk to you. A lot of people watching you. I think you did have a call talk about many men um, watching you or looking at you or some shit like that. And it says, when I hurt you, I hurt myself. And it says, someone is doing black magic on your health. So somebody could definitely want you to be um, depressed, sad, something like that to keep you stuck. And it says, I can't handle your words right now. So someone could definitely be having anxiety about whatever you're going to say back to them or something like that. Hoes is mad at you, wanting to attack you. And we got abusive wife or girlfriend. But it says, talking about your sex to others because your sex is really good. And we also got the card that says, trying to stop someone from learning the truth. So somebody trying to keep secrets from you. <clears throat> but it says, rereading your text messages. So they could be going back, looking at messages between you two. Uh, what my thing? Here we go. As soon as I open up the deck of energy for my Scorpios, they are waiting for you. On the other side, I'm in so much pain. <sighs> Can I please have a few cards for my Scorpios? Wrongful advice. So they was getting advice from the wrong people. Um, and it could have messed up y'all connection in some type of way. Seek professional advice. So you see how these cards came out? They was getting the wrong advice from people. Okay? It's a no. And it, they could still be trying to get advice from folks, but they need to stop. They just need to think with their own mind here because it's a no for both of that shit. Be more selfish. So people could want a lot out of you in some type of way. You need to be more selfish and give your energy and your sex and your time to yourself. Okay? Because there's something that you got to do. It says, I hope you'll wait for me. So there's some type of waiting period between you and your person. But it does say, I want a fresh start with you. But they got obligations to another person. If I follow you, I could lose everything. This person could be codependent in some type of way. Or someone is. Or maybe they got, their person is codependent on them. I'm too afraid to talk to you. That keeps coming out, that energy. So they have anxiety about talking to you about the situation. Uh, looks like they keep trying to run away from it, which explains that first card that we've seen. Um, you're making them want to change or making them look at things that they need to change, and it's just a bit scary, all right? A lot of people fear change. As soon as I open up the deck, the energy for my Scorpios is... Am I really that bad of a friend? Yes, bitch. So you definitely had some type of fucked up friend that was doing some fucked up shit towards you, okay? Uh, they could be questioning themselves and the things that they did, which is good because they need to do some type of self-reflection on the fucked up shit they was doing. But it says, I don't care about her like I care about you, which is showing me that somebody that you was dealing with uh, was talking to one of your friends or somebody close to you in some type of way, okay? Now they questioning themselves. Please have a few cards. This person definitely plans on marrying you, okay? Because I just seen another card saying it. Cards from my Scorpios. We got fuck him, choose me. So we did see both in the relationship. So you could be dealing with another person. But kids could be involved, which could be making the situation difficult. The kids mean a lot to me. They had to leave you because someone was threatening to expose them. It could be whoever they dealing with, okay? And it says, got caught on a date with another person. So they could they could be dealing with other people or something like that. But somebody got caught up, period. They got into it with their family about you and he put them in their place. So you did have a car talking about um he um, checked the karmic about you. Yep. I'm also saying something about somebody illegally accessing someone's medical records. And it says they would rather fight against what you're saying than actually fix themselves. So you could be speaking some real shit and telling the truth. And they'd rather argue with you because they got too much pride and ego to admit the shit that they did. And this is not necessarily just going towards your lover. This is going to some type of friend that you had. 
We also got they have done research on you. They doing a hell of a lot of research on you. It's not just your lover. It's not just this little ex friend. You got multiple people doing this. I'm also seeing something about broke into someone's house and want someone to keep it on the low. So it's a lot of secrets going on behind your back, Scorpio. And to say your family is having a group conversation about you. upset that they missed out on the opportunity with, with you because they was up there listening to lies and you need to keep people out your life until they prove themselves everybody pays attention to what you talk when you talk so you have a powerful voice especially a stud energy could be paying attention to what you're saying let's see It say his feelings for you drove the karmic insane. So the karmic going crazy trying to repo that shit. Repo man taking all that shit back. Or somebody could have just got something repoed. But he watches and wants to know everyone you're talking to, okay? You're so sexy. I want to show you off. You are coming out as that queen of wands. And you're looking very beautiful and magical. And it says they have conversations about you with someone in your family. So your fa they know somebody in your family. Somebody close to you that you see as family. And it says she would rather see him locked up than to be with you. Uh, I don't care about her like I care about you came out again. And it says you have enemies you don't know about because you're secret in my God. Okay, look, look. Um, okay, yeah, you know you love her, stuff like that. You're, you and your love of y'all in love, whatever. But you got other masculines who are in love with you, who are also in relationships that are stalking you, watching you, and got caught stalking you. And now they girlfriends got beef with you too. Hoes is mad. A lot of hoes is mad at you. Okay, Scorpio. So watch your back and protect your energy. So please like this video if it resonates at all. Thank y'all so much. I love y'all.